third take for my second part of this review because of the fact that my camera just seems to hate me. Um, so we've done the all the most of Daikaiya, so we're now going to move on to Daikai Shinkano. So. That now the fact that I've tried a few times because now I know where everything goes. Obviously these fall up and everything. So here we have Daikai Shinkano. So it looks pretty nice. Um, the Core Armor Megazord, also known as in the English version. The swords can be held in yellow and pink, but yellow really holds it too firmly and it can damage it if you try and get it out. Um, just simple articulation, just the arms, that's it. Um, Trash was the exact same way in the English toy, and there's not much else to really say about it, save electronics, all of that. Um, you can still hold a disc in these if you wanted to. And that's pretty much that. Um, he's pretty nice as a display piece overall, and I do think it looks quite nice. So now moving on to the Ikatenku Buster. kind of taking it and working my way up. So these kind of just snap into place and then you just press the button on the side in order to remove it. Voila, the Ika Tenku Master. So you can see he just stands on top of the Ika's legs, which are actually quite sturdy. Um, for the most part, I mean, it's a little bit wobbly, but there's only so much you can do. Just the top of you, all up together. And then you can still do the feature, where if you unlock everything, um, you can all spin. Just be aware of it, that it can be quite wobbly. But it does work. So, all in all, I definitely recommend that you try and get a hold of Daikaiyo, but only if you, but along with the Origami, only if you have Daikaiyo, because of the fact that, you know, like I said, by themselves, they don't really do much, but otherwise, not too bad. Um, this tailpiece, it doesn't actually really matter, thinking about it, whether you have to touch the back or not, but the official way is to have this back on the Kajiki Origami, so that it looks a bit more complete. That's the thing, so you can actually have Daikaiyo at the front. And yeah, that's pretty much that. Hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll catch you next time for my review of Mogu Daiyo. So, so long, take care.